since we are on this journey of discovering how the yogic wisdom differs from the conventional wisdom about nutrition or weight loss, let me bring out this very, very distinct or a standing out point. <laughs> Five, six o'clock time where you're just craving something, you know, lunch is over and dinner is a long way ahead. Uh, poha is a great option and you can put a lot of mirchi in it and feel really chatpata and all. And like uh, upma, how you tell uh, us, you know, they put lots of vegetables in it, so kind of it makes it even a healthier option. So even I love eating all that. and So you don't feel deprived, you don't feel that, oh, I can't eat the little yummy Indian snacks and everything so it's not just boiled down to eating gajar, kakri sticks and you know being very like prim and proper you can just eat every normal household normal stuff but still kind of lose weight and maintain your weight. I lost uh, 25 kilos because of you eating fish curry and rice every night you know when I tell my friends and I tell people they're like oh you're lying how is it possible how can you eat carbs at night and lose weight but I think the amazing thing is that, I mean, Rudruta, you've taught me how to eat right and eat what I like, uh, eat carbs and lose weight the correct way. And I think now it's become a way of life for me and I kind of endorse it like wherever I go. I tell people, please don't starve yourself and drink nimbu pani and some pattas and kind of think you're going to lose weight because it'll all come back, you know. Banana so often, chiku, you let us have. So it's not that, oh, you know, banana has too many calories in it and it's sweet. It's act actually really nutritious and gives you great energy levels, you know, when we're working or a bit stressed out and have a busy day or you're taking a flight, it's such a great option to like, you know, it fills you up and you still get all your nutrients and feel energetic. So don't just feed your children with food, but teach them to value, respect and practice our ancient food wisdom.